you reckon? It's a no from me. I don't think I'm doing well. This is definitely me in an outfit. I do just want to say I think I might be an idiot. It looks like a tea towel. Wow! Howdy, we're back. What's a popular song I can do a TikTok to? I think you might have accidentally saved my life. Oh, we can do Lizzo. <laughs> Oh, bitch, that's okay. We're doing that one. Do I do high and fast or do normal? Let's do high and fast. Hello, everyone. It's Chloe here. Welcome back to my channel. And once again, welcome back to the plus size clothing haul. I am just so grateful. I'm over the moon and I'm just extremely grateful that I get to actually do this for you guys pretty much every goddamn week nowadays. So, today's video, by the thumbnail is how do you guys already know today's video is going to be on Shein. I have how many? Two, four, six, eight pieces of clothing here. I'm very, very excited because I unpacked it this morning i literally got it today and i'm like let's do it so i have two two pieces i got two dresses two pairs of pants and two tops i'm gonna jump right into it i do want to apologize again for the lighting because it is currently pissing down with rain so i do apologize about that however i'm gonna jump right in and we will see how i think of all this stuff from sheen so again if you want to know what i got from sheen just keep on watching one two three let's switch this up Oh, hello. I should get the email up. I somehow ended up on Twitter though. What do I do first? Because I'm cold and this jumper is warm. Maybe I'll do tops first because I'm already wearing tracky dacks. Now I have to do a thumbnail and a TikTok. So just give me a second while I do that shit. That's not what I wanted. Oh my God, the mirror fell. <coughs> Can you hear my cat snoring? The first item is like a little halter top. I've been seeing these literally everywhere. This is called the Plus Bandana Hem Tie Backless Crop Halter Top. I got this in a size three extra large and this is $9 Australian. So all these prices will be in Australian. As you can see by the photo, it's just a halter neck. I love a good halter neck. And then the back is like completely backless, obviously. It was untied, so I wanted to tie it up so you guys could see what it, like, the vibe of it. So this is the halter part. This goes over your neck. So this is just the kind of, it looks like a tea towel. I'm not gonna lie, it does. It looks like a genuine tea towel, the fabric. I feel like this is like a tea towel fabric. Anyway, this goes over my neck and then this wraps around the back and it does tie up. Now, you guys know I haven't been a massive fan of my back for literal years, but I feel like I don't really give a shit right now. But the thing is I bought a lot of clothes that aren't winter related. Would I wear this in the pissing down cold? Probably not, I would layer it. <laughs> Okay, I don't know if you can hear my cat. Anyway, and then it comes down to the stomach part as like a little triangle. So it's gonna be cute, I reckon. So it's just gonna go over my head like this. It does have a little bit of stretch, like the actual like tea towel material has stretch. And so does the string. Should I close my blind? I think I should. Now the tie's probably gonna be really bad because again, I'm just doing it to do a try on. Also, armpits are not that shaven. Get over it. I feel like every time I do a haul video, someone compliment, compliments, absolutely not. Someone comments on my armpits, honey, Body hair is fucking normal, dolls. It's all right. This is actually quite cute. <laughs> I feel cute in this. I feel like I should be sipping martinis and like grease or some shit because everyone's apparently in Europe holidaying. This is a little halter. I could probably tie it a bit better than I have, but it's completely fine because it's a try on, nothing dramatic. It is quite a full coverage. I didn't, I'm not wearing a bra or anything because fuck that. You can't really see much, but you wouldn't expect to see much anyway. This is the back. So it has like a little bit of space before it enters like the tie up part. So you have a little bit of coverage at the back. Not massive amount, but you still have a little bit. Even with the trackies, I'm like, hello. I'm freezing right now, but I look cute while doing so. I like the triangle part. I honestly generally do like this type of style of top. And I feel like this is everywhere at the moment. A simple piece to start this haul off with. But I think it's also a staple piece that everyone should have in their wardrobe. Because I feel like you could pair this with basically any bottom. And I always love a halter neck because it just suits everyone's shoulders, I reckon. Highly recommend everyone getting into halter tops because it just is... It's like chef's kiss. It's absolutely stunning. First piece is a good piece. I'm happy with this. I really am. The next piece is, again, something white. I'm going to move on to the next piece, which is a bodysuit, which is quite exciting. Let me get the email up again. So next piece up is a lace bodysuit because I wanted to wear this with the two-piece set that I actually bought within this haul. Who doesn't love a good lace bodysuit? Come on now. So this next piece is called the Plus Eyelash Lace Panel Cami Bodysuit. It's $15 Australian. This is in the 
size. Four extra large. I don't think I ordered a four extra large. Or if I did, I don't remember. Because everything else is in a three or a two. I do have a red one that looks exactly like this from Pretty Little Thing, I believe. Um, it's just a white bodysuit. If it can stop twirling, then it's pretty much lace. But the boobs are covered, which is what I like in a lace bodysuit. But I wanted to wear this with like a suit type look. Like with all my suits, like my pants suits I have, I think this will be iconic as hell underneath it. Detail wise, it is a stretchy elastic, I'd say waistband, it's not a waistband, strap, which is adjustable by the way. And then this is the boob area, so you can see that it is double lined, which is good. And then the rest of this section, you can probably tell, is not double lined, which is just the like stomach area, like down here. And then it goes into a full bodysuit moment, which is very cute. I am really excited because I love simple lace pieces like this, because it just makes you feel sexy and just beautiful. It looks like it's going to be a high cut body I don't know if you can tell. I think everyone should have a bodysuit like this in their wardrobe. Like just a simple lace bodysuit. Really quickly, the clasps are just three clasps, nothing special. You've got a little bit of stretch on the back lining of the bodysuit, but the front is lace. Keep that in mind. Lace isn't really stretchy. Oh, I feel nice in it already. I'm not going to change the straps because I can do that when I actually wear it. Just looking at myself in this little mirror I have, I look sweet. <laughs> can I actually do it up or is it going to be too high? No? No, not gonna get a click. Got it. Okay. Oh, but it's not really a high body suit. It covers my bum. I feel really good. <laughs> So guys, this is the lace bodysuit. And I think, as you can tell, this is my belly button here. I think this piece over the center, I guess, of this would be where you put your high-waisted item. But this is the back. The back is fully, like, covered, I guess. And this is the only lace part. So I think this is absolutely stunning. It's a simple bodysuit. I have a red one that matches this exactly. But sometimes you can't really wear a red bodysuit with, like, a two-piece set. It has to be, like, a different color, if that makes sense. Whereas with a white one, you can wear it with basically any color. I like this. There's no boning. Like, it's just stretchy material. So, there's no boning whatsoever. With my other one, there is boning. It kind of does get a little bit annoying. So, it's just straight up stretchy material all the way around. It's not like cutting off circulation in me hoo-ha, which I don't like doing in bodysuits. I like how the boobs are covered, personally. But you have the, like, lace area here, which doesn't show much for me, personally. I think it's okay. But if you are a bit self-conscious with lace, I think this is good as well, because it doesn't show too much. Whereas it's just this section here, whereas some other lace bodysuits can show so much. So, like, no, thank you. This one's safe, I think. So, good start. Good two pieces first start. <laughs> We're gonna do some dresses now. One I'm actually scared of. The second one I bought to wear with another piece I already have in my wardrobe but I don't know if it's going to be too short or not so this is going to be very exciting. What I'm going to do is we're going to jump into the next item which I am quite excited for. I think I just popped a pimple on my back which is probably TMI but it's fine. This is called the plus split hem cable knit sweater vest without blouse. I've got a size store extra large and this is $22. I knew this wasn't going to be with the blouse because I already technically have a blouse in there from Shein that I want to wear with it so I knew for a fact that I didn't need the blouse anyway but this is basically I'm just going to show you a long sweater vest. But I'm going to try it on with the blouse. So you will get the effect that I wanted to use while getting this, if that makes sense. I'm just going to show you really quickly because, again, it's just a very simple sweater vest, but it's just long. So it just looks like this. But this is meant to be a dress, and I don't know if it's going to be long enough for me because I am 5'6". I don't know if it's going to be a mini dress or what, but it's just basically a simple sweater vest that's long. And there's two splits on, like, the side, like hem type thing. Got a V-cut, classic, classic. So what I'm going to do is just put this on with my blouse that I already own from Sheen. Ignore the blouse. I'm reviewing this, not the blouse, but I bought it to wear with a blouse. How many times did I just say blouse? Oh my god. Oh, this is too much for me, mate. Where is my blouse? <laughs> what was that? Oh, I should take my pants off. That would be fun, wouldn't it? I'm really scared because I don't, I think it's going to be short on me, which I wanted to wear as a dress. That short. Wow! That is very short. Definitely size up in this because I feel exposed. Okay, I want to put some shorts on because the pizza pieces are showing. Where are my shorts at? <laughs> okay, I actually like this though. So I'm probably going to have to wear like tights or something. Do I own tights? No. God, that is short. If you're taller than me, you're... No. <laughs> so, ignoring the blouse, I'm not re I'm not reviewing the blouse, okay? You guys understand. Oh, my lanta. It's short. So, I'm wearing shorts, like you can see here. I don't have any other sh colored shorts, so I really hope you can see how short this actually is. Like, look, this is the hem. Underneath this white bit is my shorts that I put on. I think the concept is there. I think I'd have to wear this with pants <laughs> because, like, as you can see, you can, like, that's my hoo-ha. So, like, you'd be a bit screwed. I like the concept, 
but it's definitely not a dress. I'm definitely going to wear this as a sweater vest, not as a dress. So I'm kind of disappointed in that factor because I wanted this to be a dress. But I think if you upsize, it might be longer, but then this bit would be too big for me personally. And I already got a 3X in this. I think it goes up to a 4 or a 5. I can't remember off by heart. Like, this is where I would wear shorts, right? Like, this is a normal length for shorts. This just comes above the short. And I have, like, extra flubber here, like, on my thighs, which I'm not a fan of. <laughs> you can see all of that if I don't have shorts on. It's definitely a miss in the regard of it being a dress, but I would wear this with just, like, some baggy black pants or like my leather pants that I own with just some boots or like my Converse that'd be fun. But it's definitely no as a dress but as a sweater vest itself it is a nice sweater vest just not in the way it's meant to be. And no it looks nice it's just way too short. I guess we're gonna have to see what the next dress holds. And the next dress I didn't know this is completely see-through. Shit. I'm gonna keep these shorts on and I'm gonna be wearing a black bralette. So I'm probably have to wear, I have to like get like a, like a slip. Is that what they're called? To wear this dress. But this dress is absolutely stunning. I'm obsessed. But let's move on. I do just want to say I think I might be an idiot because on the advertisement for this it does say that it's a knit sweater vest. So it doesn't actually say that it's a dress. I think I might uh, be an idiot. But she's wearing it as a dress. So I think I automatically thought that it would be a dress. But I don't know how tall she is, but she's rocking it as a dress. I think I might have exaggerated a little bit and didn't read that properly. So, sorry! This next piece again. So, this next piece is a bit risque, even for me. <laughs> this is called the Plus Zebra Striped Cutout Bodycon Dress. This is $15, and I got this in a size. Let me double check where the tag is. I got this in a size 3 extra large. <laughs> so, as you can see by the photo, the model is a stunning person. All right, she is wearing definitely some nipple covers. Um, I don't have big boobs like her, so and then I think she's wearing like high waisted black underwear. So I'm just gonna keep my shorts on. I'm probably gonna have to just wear a black bodysuit. Do I have a black bodysuit? You will be able to tell, but this is the front, it's basically zebra print mesh, and then you have these little peep holes. There's four of them, and it goes all the way down into a dress. It is completely see through, it doesn't have an undergarment, so I'm probably gonna have I'm gonna not probably. I'm gonna have to buy an undergarment for myself. The actual zebra print part, I guess, is a bit velvety. So keep that in mind if you're not a massive fan of velvet, but it's not like bad in a way. Like, you know how, like, there's a lot of velvet, you can get pieces that, like, have so much velvet as overpowering. Powing. <laughs> this isn't bad at all. But the actual like print itself is really pretty. There is a bit of stretch. As soon as you stretch it, it does kind of dismorph. Dis morph i don't think i'm doing well <laughs> i feel like i'm gonna look really weird in this but i feel like if i get a like the proper undergarment for this i'm gonna look sickening i'm just wearing this bralette so you're gonna see the word bonds and i'm wearing those black shorts so let's not like think too much into it i guess it is stretchy what did i get a throat extra large so we'll see if this fits with me oh okay that would be a cool top too look at that so i see the concept and as soon as i get an undergarment for this i'm gonna i'm gonna be fantastic <laughs> what am i even doing <laughs> that's fine with me <laughs> the concept is stunning i'm just gonna have to buy like a like a black dress under this you're gonna have to kind of excuse the bralette and the shorts but this is the concept i'm actually obsessed if i buy a slip or like a bodysuit to wear under this i'm gonna feel fantastic i love this it's stretchy like you can see there's like stretch to it and like this detail is stunning i'm really happy with this until i buy something underneath it it's gonna be fantastic so this is a bit of an up close on the pattern which you can't really see unless it's on the body like i think it's cute this is really nice <laughs> this makes me feel incredible if i didn't have like bonds written here i think if it was full black it'd be fine and then just wear the shorts i think that would be fine as well i think it's just a bit obvious because it has bonds and it's white but if i just had a black bralette on i'd be looking snatched i like this okay i think now we're going to move on to pants i think for the next part i'm going to put on the bodysuit again so then i can do the pants and the two pieces you guys know i love funky pants and the first thing i saw on the sheen website when i was looking for stuff to get is this what Oh my god, first of all, I just I have no reaction to these. This is incredible. <laughs> this was literally my first pick of like this entire haul was these pants. But these are the plus dopamine. <laughs> 
Isn't that a drug? Dressing floral and geoprint flare leg pants. These are $17 and I got this in a size 3 extra large. We got more flare pants. I did get green flare pants from Shein and I did wear them to Trixie and Katia on this set of photo. They look incredible. I love them. But this is just something else. So you have an elastic waistband and then the actual material is stretchy as well. But again, if you stretch it too much, it does kind of have a fade of the material or a pattern, whatever you want to call it. Let's try it on. Hopefully they fit. <laughs> where I'd wear these two but I love the fact that I have them all right all right okay so again I've already shown you this bodysuit so I wanted to show you something that we've already seen but these are the pants we're gonna focus on the pants these are incredible look how groovy I am like this is the flare there's no line like last time to see where the flare is I am so in love I don't even know what else to say these are really comfy too <laughs> This is so fun. I know not everyone's gonna like these. I know that. These are something else. Love these. The flare is really cool as well. It's not too large, so I still can wear shoes with them. Like they're stretched, there's a bit of looseness, which is good, so I can eat a full ass meal. I think I kind of prefer these over the green ones, if I'm being completely honest with you guys. I don't know, something about flared patterned pants. Patterned pants in general make me the happiest girl in the world, <laughs> which is sad, but I really hope the next pair looks good too, because the next pair is something else. I don't even know what to say about them. They're really, really pretty, but I know not everyone's going to like them, which is completely fine. I do, and if you do too, the link's down below. <laughs> We're going to move on to another pair of pants, which I think hopefully people will like. I don't know if they will, though. They're green, but they have different colors on the website. This is called the Plus High Waist Wide Leg Pant. This is $23, and I got a size 3 extra large. Now, they have this color. They have a pink, a brown, a darker green, and a black. And I'm pretty sure all sizes are sold out in this color. But I'm going to still link it down below, and you can choose whatever color you fancy. I don't know about you, but these look pretty. Look at these. You be a fucking new kid. What is happening? Elastic waistband like normal and then it's this material that kind of like, what's the word I'm thinking of? I don't even know what the word I'm thinking of. It has like ruching but it's also not ruching all the way down. It looks a little see-through, not gonna lie. I'm wearing black underwear so you will be able to tell and it has like a little bit of a flare. Not really but it kind of just flares out. I feel like they're gonna be a bit high-waisted too so I am so excited. They're long. I'm gonna have to alter these. Definitely size down in these. I don't know if you're able to see a lot, but this, I feel like Squidward. Why do I feel like Squidward? But these are the pants. Um, I do have black underwear on and you can see the white bodysuit as well. You can't see it that much when you don't stretch the material, but I think definitely wear some new color underwear with them. You can see how long they are. If you wear a boot, maybe it's not gonna be that long, but, but these are really comfortable. Definitely downsize in this piece. I like it though. I think it looks good with the white as well. But no, honestly, I know they're oversized. So definitely size down in them. But I think they look cool. Like if I had like a proper top on, maybe not this bodysuit because I feel like it just clashes a little bit. I like these. Just definitely uh, if you are interested in getting any of the colours, definitely size down because again, you got a lot of room. I can probably fit another person in there. I do like them. Definitely size down. Definitely wear nude colour underwear with them. We have two pieces left and they're both two piece sets. One is technically a like suit set, which I'll show last because I'm very excited. And the other one's kind of like a short two piece set. So it's like a, like a little top and some shorts which is very exciting who doesn't love a good ginnem ginnem is that is that the word i'm thinking of i don't even know this next piece is called the plus gingham patched pocket blouse and shorts this is 24 dollars, and i got a size three extra large this looks sickening on the model so i had to try it it's not really short weather here these shorts do not have pockets first of all but these are the shorts they kind of look like bed shorts i'm not gonna lie but it's gonna be fine and then you have a button down little top with a collar the model is wearing an unbuttoned so i think i'm gonna wear unbuttoned with this bodysuit on which i think is gonna look good because of the white so it's pretty simple, pretty self-explanatory. I'm going to whack this on. I'm going to talk about it a little bit more. I don't know which way is front and back. So I'm just going to take a gamble. I'm getting so cold. Okay, this is the vibe. I probably wouldn't wear it with this bodysuit though. Again, I would probably wear something either black or white under this, but not lace because there are a lot of patterns going on. But this is really cute as a set. I actually really like this. <laughs> I feel like I should be going to camp or something. I actually really like this. Would I wear it separately? Probably not these shorts. I think the shorts will have to go with the top. I probably wouldn't button this up if I'm being 
honest because it does look like it is meant to be a PJ set. But I can always like tuck this in, style it kind of like this. It's not really see-through, but again, I would probably wear something lighter colored at the bottom. This is comfy. I'm cold, but that's not the point of it. It's oversized shorts, so it's not tugging on my thighs, which is always a plus because my thighs are massive. We understand that. I don't like friction. It's not fun. The shirt isn't really oversized. It's actually pretty fitting. It's got a little bit of like a circle, like a wave cut, I guess you want to call it. I like this. This is definitely like a vacation-y vibe. I would love to wear this to the beach or just something like that. Not now. Obviously, it's winter. I'm doing that on myself. I generally like this piece. It's really pretty. I actually like this. I don't know why I sound so shocked. I don't know. I think as a whole, this is stunning. It, this, I feel like this is me in an outfit. Like, I feel like it's just it's my vibe, my colors. I don't know. It's very casual, but like it's... It shows that you're putting in effort. <laughs> we have my last set. We have my last piece, I guess. And it is a suit. What do you call them? Because a suit to me can be like a full suit. But then like a pantsuit is like a casual suit. Anyway, it's pink. Have fun. So this next piece and our last piece of the whole video is probably it's the most expensive, hands down. So this is the plus double button front plate. Plater? <laughs> Plaid blazer and pants set. This is $57 Australian and I got a size 3 extra large. I'll show you the pants first because I think the pants are kind of more scarier than the blazer part. But this is the pattern. I did have a vibe of wearing this Tarry Styles because at the time I was thinking of going. I am now going to two shows. I'm going to Melbourne and Sydney. <laughs> so I have to think of two different outfits. And I feel like this is definitely a potential for next year. These are the pants. You have two loopholes that's it actually just two loopholes on the front so i'm not really sure actually you don't you have one in the back you don't have pockets but i think the blazer has pockets so i think that'd be okay I and mean, if i just fold it to show you the pattern it does look like it's going to cut off like ankle length which is always a plus i don't have to alter it which is fun so those are the pants and jacket the jacket has shoulder pads in it which you can just easily rip out but i know it looks cute I think it's cute. Let me check the pockets because last time I did one of these, I had to rip it open and I have to rip these open. So there, there is workable pockets. You just have to rip them open. It has a very open kind of op opening. <laughs> you have one button. You do get a spare button, by the way. I have put it away already. So you have two buttons here. You have one in the outer corner and then one in the inner. Basically, is the outline of an actual proper suit that people get tailored made I guess. I'm going to leave this open and wear the bodysuit underneath because my plan was to wear that suit and a lace bodysuit to Harry Styles. Am I going to wear it? I don't know yet. I'm going to Harry with Tori, my friend Tori in uh, February in Melbourne and then I'm flying to Sydney to spend time with Annalisa and going to Harry's last Australian concert with her. Which is going to be insane. Oh my battery's going to die. That's also great when I'm half naked. Okay let me whack this on and I'll change it. So pants are going to go on which I'm scared of. Oh, they f what is that? There's a truck outside my house. They fit and I think I have a delivery. Okay, let me put this jacket on and change the battery. If I can get the buttons out. Oh God. Oh, you have an inner button. Right, okay. So this is the inner button and then that's the one that's actually meant to go in the buttonhole. Mate. I'm gonna flip you around and I feel like I could run a business. Well, I do, but <laughs> I probably could never fire anyone. But I feel like in this outfit, I probably could. This is kind of what I was going for with the bodysuit in mind. So if I pose a little bit, you can see what I was thinking of. You have the inner button here, which goes in um, this buttonhole here, but then this one over here goes all the way here. I'm probably not a massive fan of it done up. However, the blazer looks cute by itself. Not gonna lie. Pants fit superbly. I'm actually very very happy with the pants um the length is actually phenomenal uh ankle wise for me and the blazer isn't tight or anything it fits pretty well and i'm actually very excited again i had to fix the pockets up but this is probably one of my favorite pieces ever <laughs> i think i look incredible if i'm being completely honest with you guys i feel like i could just grab my drink yell at some people get annoyed with myself because i feel like running your own business you have to yell at someone and it's obviously yourself <laughs> love that i feel like a bad bitch in this i really do it's just something i do with pants suits that make me feel incredible even with the shoulder pads iconic I, that's all i gotta say i'm absolutely iconic oh my god that's all for today's haul guys i am literally obsessed i'm pretty sure i have a discount code for you guys i'll leave it all down below don't stress my cat is now looking at herself which has been a fun ride for us but i am obsessed with every single piece everything fits which is good i think for me me having the like the idea of the sweater vest being a dress is probably the only downfall however it wasn't it wasn't advertised as a dress that's me it's my problem i'm an idiot <laughs> but honestly everything is pretty good uh the green pants are a bit long i just have to alter them besides that i don't think anything else is 
bad, which is fantastic to say. We're doing well with hauls. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, give it a thumbs up for me. Again, thank you to Sheen for letting me try your clothes out once again. Um, it's always a fun time and I'm always extremely grateful. So I get everything for their website, discount codes, everything like that will be linked down below as well as everything I tried on in order and my sizes will be down there as well. Also my Instagram, my small business, everything like that. We link down below like always. If you are new here, please subscribe. I make a video every single Thursday at 12 p.m. for you guys, which is exciting. I think that's pretty much it, and that's all I have to say. But remember to spread love and stay positive, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye everyone. Say bye. Oh, good girl. <laughs>